You know, when you lose a few pounds, you might find saggy skin. Well, Morning Express wants to help you if you're working on your dream body. And viewer Sean of the U.S. Army, for example, writes, how do you get rid of excess skin around your waist after you've lost weight and gotten into shape? Sean, this is fitness expert Jim Karras to help you. This is a tough question because there's a couple of pieces of background that would be helpful. Number one, how quickly did he lose the weight? The faster you lose the weight, unfortunately, the more muscle you may frequently lose. Therefore, you're going to get a little bit more sagging skin. Question number two for him is how much weight did he lose? Are we talking 20 pounds, 50 pounds, 100 pounds? Because the skin does change the elasticity depending upon how much he lost and also his age because it's going to bounce back faster the younger you are. I would love to see him really hit his strength training in his upper and lower body. If he rebuilds some of his muscle, and I said upper in particular, I kind of want to lift the skin back up. So think about it. If you build a little bit more chest, a little bit more shoulder, and he's dealing with some abdominal excess skin, yes, we may be able to bring it up. Interestingly enough, crunches, abdominal exercises, waste of time. So those are not the exercises he needs to be doing. He needs to be really trying to rebuild, especially some upper body muscle. Let's see if we can build that back up.